Here is what happened on the latest edition of Morning Glory. Something that might interest you. Um, are you looking for a job? Uh, are you looking for a new career opportunity uh, with no experience or education required? Right now, in a magazine I've just picked up here, um, and it's a, a Time magazine here, you could become a condom tester. Yes, there's 500 positions. <laughs> I don't know if that's 500 positions you've got to test it in, or there's 500 positions of, uh, well, of jobs waiting for you. But anyway, male or female, uh, you must be at least 20 years of age. No educational qualifications are necessary. You've got to be willing to provide condom testing services for the first time in Thailand. Now, what it entails, I don't know, but I'm going to uh, investigate, I think. Click to apply for your dream job uh, now at www.durex.co.th. Now, <laughs> while you're doing that, here's a little story uh, re uh, related. An 18-year-old girl finally had the opportunity to go to a party by herself. And since she was very good looking, she was a bit nervous about what to do if boys started hitting on her. Her mum said, well, it's very easy. Whenever a boy starts hitting on you, you just ask him, what will be the name of our baby? That'll scare him off. So off she went. And after a while, yeah, boys started hitting on her. And each time they started uh, kissing her or touching her, she said, what will be the name of our baby? And of course, then the boys just disappeared. Uh, but then uh, this went on for quite a few times until one guy did the same thing with her, started um, chatting her up. And she said, uh, what will our baby be called? Uh, and he continued with her and took her into a, a, a private room and he, and he started taking her clothes off. She said, what will our baby be called? Uh, it, it, but then he, he just carried on. He started to have sex with her. And she says, what will our baby be called? And after he was done, he took off his full condom. He tied it in a knot and he said, well, if he gets out of this one, let's call him David Copperfield. <laughs> Live on 96FM Morning Glory.